in this video we're going to look at how to do a paired t test using SPSS. We're going to go through the instructions in chapter 8 on this and we're also going to use the example data from chapter 8 on the time spent grazing by ewes when they have lambs and when they don't have lambs. Let's have a look at the data file. You can make this data file yourself or, and there's separate help on that, or you can download it pre-prepared from the online resource centre. Notice here we have the dependent variable split between the two categories of the independent variable related to ID. So we've got three columns. One is a sort of reference column we don't use in analysis and here are our two columns of data and the items on the same case are the, re are the ones that are related. Right, I think we're ready to crack on with the analysis. Let's go to Analyze Compare Means. We want the paired sample t-test. And we click our two columns with our data in. Flick those over. And we go OK. And in our output, we have the value of the t-statistic, the degrees of freedom, the p-value, and by default, an estimation of the effect size and the confidence intervals for that effect size. So everything you need to report there for in relation to a paired t-test. And that's it. That's how to do a paired t-test using SPSS.